Good afternoon, everyone. How are we all doing? Congrats on first, Jay. Welcome, Ian and Loon. Welcome, Ian. I hope you're well. HJ, thank you for the luck. I appreciate it. If I need your help, I will scream out to you and we'll see how it goes. Tattoo, tattoo. Ooh. Tattoo. You can see a little sliver of it there. Hello, welcome in again. <laughs> no, nah, it's here. Let me kind of turn my arm. There we go. Can TikTok see it? Yes. This the tattoo. It's the Doom Slayer symbol from Doom. It looks really cool in the camera, actually. It's literally about an hour ago. Got it finished, so... She's still a bit swollen and like scratchy and red, but I'm keen to see how it's going to heal. It's going to look awesome healed, but I am very happy with it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. So that's it. Huzzah on me arm. I, I like it. I'm happy with it. Right? Doesn't it look good? I wanted it to, yeah, kind of look like it had been carved into my skin like the actual doom slayer so i'm chuffed with it but yeah so i got that done today cheeky little hour hour sitting nice and easy nice and quick didn't hurt didn't hurt but that's just me <laughs> that's just me um i do have a headache great i woke up with one again today it's not bad enough that it's like stopping me from doing things, hence why I'm streaming and I'm not bedridden, but it's bad enough that it's just fucking annoying and it won't go away no matter what medication I take because it's related to my neck again. I have been getting massages every two weeks and my neck is still, I don't know what I've done to it for it to be like this, but it is so sore all the time. I think I need to swap pillows again and see if that helps. Because it is so sore. Like right up at my hairline. At the base of my skull. is so fucking sore. And it's giving me a headache. So. We will see. If it gets any worse on stream. We will have to call it early. Um, but so far. It hasn't been getting better at all today it's not yeah like bad enough for me to be bedridden i can still do stuff it's just not going away and it's annoying and it hurts <laughs> so we'll see how we go with it uh like i said if it gets worse we'll have to call it early but we'll see how we go for now um we're not ending yet james don't worry don't worry we're only just starting um i was just saying i've got a headache so if it gets any worse we'll have to call it but it's all right for now. It's just annoying. Um, I've taken all the medicine I have. None of it's working because, of course, it's neck related. Um, the tattoo is this. It's the Doomslayer symbol. I like it. I'm chuffed with it. And a Pokemon of the day for Soviet. Random Pokemon generator. Ooh, fun. We have Hisuian Braviary. He kind of looks like he has an afro. That's fun. I think that's fun. But yes, otherwise we are doing good. Seeing of getting the elite heretic mark from Halo. Or from Doom. That's still cool though. Hello Norman from Halo. Yeah, nice. That'd be good as well. Pokemon of the day for you, Norman. We have Clawf. Good old cloth. There is also a young goose in chat. Do I have a young goose is the question. I do not. I will try and catch it. There we go. So yeah, I have a headache, which is just great. I'm getting them a lot again because of my neck, which is so annoying because I'm going and getting massages like every fortnight and my neck is still giving me trouble and I don't know what to do because there's nothing else I can really do. But... Great. Fantastic. So, we shall see. We shall see how it goes. I've taken everything I can for it and it's not going away, so we just kind of have to live with it. They don't last, like, more than a day, 
usually the neck ones, but it's just annoying. I even put like ice gel on it this morning, which didn't do shit. So I think I need heat gel, um, which I do have. I just wanted to try the ice gel because I prefer it, but I have to do heat gel. Been trying to like rub at it, but doing that makes the headache worse. And because it's like right up at the base of my skull, it just, it hurts to press. Because that's me skull. <laughs> so, Gabe, welcome in. How you doing? Oh, Luna's welcome in. How you doing? We're just getting started. I'm complaining about a headache, don't you worry. Dang, out of all of us that tried to catch that young goose, Loon was the only one who caught it. That's crazy. Sorry, I'm like trying to pressure point my neck right now. What's the haps, Norman? What's going on? Oh, but with all of that aside, we're playing some Resident Evil 2 today. I do apologize that stream is much later than it was supposed to be. Um, the owies are still owing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear that. We're both owie right now. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, stream was supposed to be 10 a.m. this morning. It is now 4.30 p.m. Um, basically, TLDR, after last night's stream, where the game had a boob in it, I decided that it would be in my best interest to download the VOD, blur out the section of the boob in my editing software to then upload it to YouTube so that YouTube didn't get mad at me. You heard right, Norman boob <laughs> so that yeah youtube didn't get mad at me um and so i did that this morning and i was rendering out the video and it was like it said it would take two hours to render and i'm like perfect because at this point it was two hours before i was going to start stream so i'm like awesome um that'll be perfect rendering the video and then i come check on it two hours later just before i'm about to start stream to be like oh it'll be done blah 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 and it says 42% and that it has like six hours remaining. So I'm like, oh, great. That's fine. It can just render in the background. So I go to open up my apps to start streaming OBS and everything. And they just crash. They just crash. Um, so obviously the rendering process and DaVinci Resolve is a bit too much for my computer to handle and none of my other apps would open. So I'm like, you know what, it's fine. We'll just have to postpone stream and I'll just stream after I come back from my tattoo. I came back from my tattoo and I checked the render. It was still stuck at 42% and the timer had gone up to nine hours. So I just said, fuck it. And I canceled the render. I canceled the edit. I've just exported the video straight to YouTube. So that's doing its thing now. Um, so we'll see if YouTube yells at me. If it does, I'll take the video down and I'll try the render again. Uh, I was talking to some people about it and it sounds like there's a section of the footage that's corrupted somehow in the downloading process. So I'm basically going to have to chop the footage up into a bunch of different parts and try and work out which section's the issue so that I can cut it out. So we'll see what happens. Maybe YouTube's going to be okay with the boob. I did set the video to 18 plus just in case. Uh, but if YouTube's going to yell at me about it, I'll delete it and I'll try the render process again and try and find the dud bit of footage. So fingers crossed. We'll see how it goes. But that's why I'm late. Because um, my computer doesn't like DaVinci Resolve. And Jet Cloud, welcome Ian. It's good to have you. <laughs> Everyone's just boob, boob, boob boob you heard me you know the rule random colors all righty orange i don't think we've had orange in a while orange is very interesting a collectible i can do that all right let me go grab something and it's actually going to be on theme today The little Umbreon, yeah, that's our channel mascot. He's a little zombie Umbreon. Because we play a lot of horror games in Resident Evil. Happy hug! Yay! 
Santa, he's our little mascot. But I grabbed something on theme since we're starting Resident Evil 2 today. I grabbed the liquor statue because it feels fitting. This is still like my favorite yeah. thing ever. <laughs> it's still like my favorite. He's so cool. He's licking a boob. No. Yeah, the barbed tongue. It's like actually kind of sharp too. His little little tailbone. Boop boop boop. He's kind of dusty. That's okay. Yeah, he's sick. Hopefully we don't encounter those today. <laughs> Evie and Umbreon are my faves. Yes, Umbreon's my favorite. Gengar is a close second. Gengar used to be my favorite, but wooden or steel? Uh, resin, I believe, or acrylic. It's some sort of plastic, but. Works. Some kind of plastic. No, Gengar used to be my favorite, but since it's a trade evolution and I didn't have access to trades for a very long time in Pokemon, um, he sort of sort of dipped down a little bit because I wasn't able to ever use him. We've got the whole lot today. The whole lot today, Norman. Oh, Loon said they were a bat. Wood or steel, valid. Very valid. Hello, Lord. How you doing? Right, let's get into the game then before we waste any more time. So we are starting Resident Evil 2 today, the original, the PS1 Resident Evil 2. We are starting our A campaign as Claire, so we're going to be doing Claire A, Leon B for our first run. I am excited and I am nervous. Um, love being called Lord. <laughs> we're going to roll with it. Not wasting time at all. We're going straight in today because I'm already late and I don't know if this is going to be a full length stream or not. So just in case it's not, I don't want to waste time. Um, especially since Resident Evil, we can't just save and end whenever we want, you know. So playing Resident Evil 2. I'm nervous about how it's going to go because these PS1 games are not very forgiving at all. But we have knowledge from Resident Evil 1. So, we'll see how it goes. I'm also excited to see how it differs from uh, the remake. Because Resident Evil 2 Remake, so far out of the games I've played, is my favorite Resident Evil. So we'll see how it goes. We have our death counter ready to go. I'm just going to shuffle it over a little bit. There we go. That looks a bit better. I we are playing this on the PS3, but it is physical hardware. It is the real disc, the real game. The nostalgia. We're about to get hit with nostalgia. Just remember, I have milk duds. Hell yeah, milk duds are I. I had some Tim Tams earlier before my tattoo appointment. You are all good. Violence and gore. Oh no, how will we cope? And I have beef stroganoff for dinner. So that's what I'll be eating after stream. I don't have to cook. And then tomorrow I'll be making a chicken Cajun mac and cheese. Because now that I worked out how to make mac and cheese, um, I've got some cheese left over from the charcuterie board I had on the weekend. So I'm going to mix that in. Oh, what a transition. Hell yeah, dude. I'm so excited for this. I'm very keen. I know this is a lot of people's like favorite Resident Evil of all time. So I'm very keen, and I'm curious to see how it differs from the remake as well. So I've already gone through the options. There isn't really much in there, honestly. Um, so we're just going to jump into a new game. Ooh, I do get a choice. I do get a choice, normal or easy. Uh, I'm inclined to do easy. Let me look up the difference. <laughs> Welcome back. 
Normal versus Easy. Resident Evil 2 PS1. I just want to see what the difference is, if it's anything crazy. I don't know. My my body is telling me easy, but like I could be overreacting. I. Oh, what's it doing? Okay, it's just it's just going through its little demo thing. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Most people are saying normal. What does Reddit say? It's not horror if you're not sweating buckets. I know, but I don't want to like. I don't want to have another Code Veronica experience because that game was hard. All right. How does one stroke beef? You ask the farmer. Oh my god. You are unstoppable. Easy seems like your best option. See, normally I'd go easy. But I've played every other Resident Evil on normal. Or standard. So I'm like, should I keep the trend? The general consensus seems to be normal. Lots of people are saying that easy difficulty is just way too much ammo. You like start with a shit ton of health. And I'm not talking about in a fight. <laughs> touche. That's touche right there. Yeah. Yeah, easy. Apparently you get like double the bullets. And you can basically kill everything in like one to two shots. So I think we're going to go normal. And yeah, it will stick with the trend then. I've only played the remake as well, Loon. So I'm excited. I'm just here to see some pixel titties. Hopefully there will be no boobs this time. All right. Normal it is. Hell yeah, dude. Alright, we're going normal. We'll see if I regret this. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed everything is okay. A bizarre incident occurred oh shit, info dump. It's so quiet. I can't hear shit. We love not having subtitles. I can barely hear what it's saying. Stars. What a throwback, right, Kay? It's just like recounting the events of the first game, basically. Start of RE2, you're right in time. Katsu Cafe. God, I could go for a Katsu right now. Oh, it wouldn't have been fitting if I got a Resident Evil tattoo today instead. I will at some point. I will at some point. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. There's also a sand dial in chat. Do I have a sand dial? I do not. I will be getting an RE tattoo one day loon. I'm still just deciding on what to get. My original thinking was the Umbrella Corporation logo. So I might do that. I've also been throwing around the idea of getting a zombie Umbreon tattoo, kind of like my channel mascots, but more realistic. So like combining basically an Umbreon with a Cerberus dog, because I want to get an Umbreon tattoo at some point as well, but I don't know what style to get it in. So I was like, maybe I can smush them. So I'm not 100% sure, actually. Does he have a name? He doesn't, actually. I've just been calling him Zombrion. 
which is still kind of cool. Is anyone here? Hello? Oh, definitely. I know I'm getting a Gengar tattoo already. And yeah, I wanted to get an Umbreon tattoo, but I'm not sure. Uh, hello? Wasn't sure what style to get it in. And I know I was a Resident Evil tattoo. So I'm like, I don't know. I've had too much to drink. Oh no. Uh oh. We're just. We are immediately starting getting into this, huh? There's no, like. Slow. Leon! God, I'm so feral for him. <laughs> Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. I'm so feral for him. Why does this game look so on point? It's fine. To be fair, we're playing this on a PS3. It's the original PS1 disc, but in a PS3. So I think it does upscale it a little bit. You're getting a tattoo on Thursday, Loon? What's going on? Have you said what you're getting yet? Trust me, it looks a lot better on stream what you're seeing. Nice to meet you. On my, like, fucking 40-inch TV, it doesn't look great. <laughs> you're getting three on Thursday? Jesus Christ. If a zombie attacked, what would be the first thing you would do? Cry. Listen, I'm telling you, if an actual zombie apocalypse breaks out, I'm not making it through. No way in hell. You're getting one as well, Jay. Oh my god, we're just all getting tattoos now. The oldest Zelda games. Like the fucking CDI Zelda games. Ugh. He needs drugs when you have tats, okay. right? This is my fourth that I got today. And I want to get another one or two this year as well. I have a bunch planned, but I want to get a bunch of my smaller ones done this year. The smaller, cheaper ones. A little moon on my hand, the shy boo on my shoulder, and the snail on my wrist. Yes! Hell yeah, dude. Sure, if I turn mine on, my copy would look at it on my TV too. Like, it doesn't look bad. But the lines are definitely a little jaggedy. And the aspect ratio is, like, tiny against my screen. Gonna get the Sheikah eye from Zelda on the back of my neck soonish. That's cool. They were parted by an unescapable destiny. Ooh. Oh shit, yeah, fucking alright. Fuck! Nope. Brother! Oh, this is not off to a good start. Hello? Hello? This is not going well. Fuck, dude, they're everywhere. Damn, this game really said, do you remember how to use tank controls? I hope you do. Bloody hell. Just straight into it. Do you try and let me switch my Twitch badge? Like the little 2023 one? I went with normal, Loon. That's weird. Yeah, no, this just jumps straight into it. If I ever get a tattoo IRL, it'll be a little Eevee on my wrist. Oh my gosh, yes. Like the sub badge? The founder? I don't know if you can change the founder. Freeze. Freeze. I'm frozen. Who are you? Kendo? What are you doing here? Don't shoot! I'm a human! First shiny was a Diglett. My first shiny was a Woobat. Oh, the ball? The bits badge? Sorry about that, babe. Sorry. I thought you were one of them. You are all good. Take your time. Hold on. The Pokeballs? Yeah, that's the bit badge. They used to be the sub badges, but the sub badges are the little um, Nintendo consoles now. 
So I changed the Pokeballs to the Bits ones. Let me remember the controls. No. So squares run. Okay, circle is inventory. Oh, we're still on fine. After getting grabbed three times, we're still on fine. Okay, so we've got a knife and a handgun, eight inventory slots, and we have a lock pick. Okay. We've got our map. How do I get out of the map? There we go. We've got our files. All right. Sub, but it doesn't give me the option to change it to my sub one instead of the bits. That's weird. For me, it's showing it's got the mod badge, the sub founder, and then the like 2023. The one we got from like looking at our like Twitch annual stats. Be fine. I, I got grabbed by a zombie three times on the way here. I'm surprised we're still on fine. That looks like ammo. Can I have, please? Can I... Is there anything here for me? Paraphernalia. All right. Let me grab this ammo. There we go. Yes, I will. I found her as counted as my sub badge, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, I see the Pokeball now. I see the Pokeball now. I was going to try and read that notebook, but I guess it's not actually... Oh, shit. Kendo, no! Kendo! Oh, brother. Alright. Is there anything else I can grab here? Hell yeah! Oof, 30 bullets. Any more? Okay, I think that's it. Time to go. Time to go. Where am I found a high and proud? Hell yeah, dude. 14 months. Let's go. Yeah, no, nah, I was saying before. Um, I'm going to get... I want to get a Gengar tattoo. Uh, in like an ink drip style. Um... And then, yeah, I haven't decided whether I want to do an Umbreon and the Umbrella Core logo, or whether I want to combine them and do, like, a zombie Umbreon. Oh, shit. Do I have to go back there, dude? Uh-oh. Okay. At least we've got plenty of space. If I can cut it down to maybe, like, one zombie, and then run past him. They're all just getting back up, though, which isn't ideal. Okay, go. Go, 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 go. Off. Get off. Get off. Fucking go. Get out. Get out. Oh, for fuck's sake. Dude, they're everywhere. How am I supposed to breathe in this goddamn place? Zombrion. <laughs> Yeah, so I don't know whether to do a zombie Umbreon or whether to do the Umbrella logo and an Umbreon. But I know I definitely want a Gengar. Um, oh yeah, now we're hurt. Now we're hurt. Okay. Uh, I should probably reload. Um, I know I also want a Studio Ghibli tattoo. And I know I at the least want soot sprites on my collarbones. But I don't know whether to do just that or to do like a whole chest piece and do like my original plan was like soot sprites and then maybe like the princess Mononoke wolf down one shoulder um, and the dragon from Spirited Away on the other shoulder and do something like that because I'm not sure if I want a whole chest piece or I could also do like Maybe, like, the dragon or something around my shoulder. I'm not 100% sure. I know I want something Studio Ghibli. I just don't know exactly how to lay it out yet. Yeah, no, I picked the normal difficulty. Um, do you go by Katsu or do you prefer something else? Is that more ammo? I can't tell. Go back. 
kind of want a little no face. Yeah. And then do like a no face like down in between my boobs or something. Yeah, I'm, I'm not 100% sure how I want to lay it out. Katsu's cute. I like it. I hear zombies, but I can't see them and that concerns me. I'm like scared. They're everywhere. You just can't stop saying boobs. How else do you call that? Maybe sternum? I don't actually know the, the technical name for it. Fuck you want me to do? Oh jeez. Do you reckon I can just... Oh shit, they can get me from here. Alright then. Uh... If I can just clear her out... And then I can skeet round these other guys. There we go. Oh, fuck! Because, like, I highly doubt I'm really going to be coming back to this area. Right? <laughs> we can sell you. Ew. What is that noise? The fixed camera angles are scary because I can't see what's coming. Fucking skeet past these guys. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get in. Get in the fucking bus. There we go. <sighs> yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It's just like the starting area. Oh, Jesus Christ. There's so many. Hello? Give. Give. Give me the ammo. We've got a decent amount of ammo, though. Oh, hello. Oh, shit, dude. This is giving uh, Resident Evil Zero. Cheeky little train section. I'm nervous. My husband and I are getting a random blind tattoo, meaning we're going in, they have a book full of random tattoos with numbers, they roll the dice, whatever it lands on you get. Ooh. So it's like those, it's like a get what you get sort of thing. That's nice. They give you a ton compared to RE1. You would hope so, because there's, there's a higher enemy count. I'm going this way. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I'm, yeah, I'm so dead. Damn. That is not a good start. <laughs> we go right back to the start now. Oh dear. That's not good. <laughs> What's load game? I don't have a save file, do I? Yeah. That's what I was thinking. I don't have a save file. Usually get what you get you see beforehand. Oh, yeah. Because you'd like take it out, get the number. Yeah, so you literally won't know what it is till it's on your body. That's scary. I don't know if I'd do something like that, honestly. If I did, it'd have to be like a small little flash tattoo or something. It wouldn't be anything big. Hello, Chu! I've been to Adelaide once. <laughs> I'm in Queensland, though. Excuse me. No, I went to Adelaide back when... You guys know Dan and Phil, the YouTubers? Back when they did their first ever Australian tour, I went and saw their show down in Adelaide. It was nice down there. We had family there at the time. But it was nice. I remember that was right when Pokemon Go came out too. So I was like walking around the city everywhere, like catching Pokemon and being amazed that there were so many Pokemon spawning. Because um, I come from a rural town. So at that point, before they'd like 
buffed Pokemon Go to make the spawns more common. We got like no spawns down here. So I just remember being shocked that there were like Pokemon everywhere. Three by three, that's not so bad. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh fuck, I ran straight back into him. Oh, at least you kind of pushed them away. That's good. Okay, we, we gotta think about this, right? We gotta think about this now. So we don't get grabbed four times again. Let me the fuck in. The classic, yes! This is my first time playing it. So we, we'll see how it goes. I can't believe I've already died once. That's embarrassing. <laughs> I'm good, Swaggy. How are you? I have a little bit of a headache, but what are you doing here? I'm all right. Can't blame Don't zombies falling to nom on player. That's fair. That's fair, detective. I do like her classic red vest look. Oh, sorry about that, babe. Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. I wish there were subtitles. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, I've had a headache all day. It's another headache from my fucking neck. By the time I know that something is wrong, We've, we use centimeters. I know roughly how big inches are, but we, we use centimeters mostly. Alright, there was nothing in there. When I have time, I jump on 64 Mario Party and James Bond. Hell yeah, dude. Classics. I'm pretty sure GoldenEye is on the Switch emulator, I think. I know for a fact Mario Party is. I'm sorry, Kendo. I love you, I'm sorry. Golden Eye is yes. <laughs> Alright, grab these ones and then we'll be on our way. See post bat headache, yeah. I've been getting them a lot again because of my neck. Even though I've been getting my neck dealt with, it's still very sore. And so it's giving me headaches again, and because they're neck-related headaches, muscle-related headaches, instead of my regular migraines, my medicine doesn't get rid of them. Which is really awesome. Um, so I'm just kind of stuck with them. And it's not, like, bad enough that I can't stream or anything. It's just, um... Just annoying, because it won't go away, and there's nothing I can do about it. 7x7? Seven seven? Okay, that's a decent size. Yeah, this, this one I got today on my arm is 10 centimeters. Was there anything back here? Yeah, there was the ammo here. Yeah, there's the remastered GoldenEye as well, but from what I've heard, the remaster... ...wasn't great. Oh my god, dude. Actually, fuck off. There we go. There we go. And then can I whoop? There we go. Get out of it. Yeah, I got the Doomslayer symbol on my arm um, about three hours ago, actually. I feel like I remember there being something here. Okay, no, we're good. I wanted another one, and so I got one. PS5, yeah. I love my PS5. I think it might be one of my favorite consoles that I have. That and my DS's. Yes, no, I will definitely be playing um, the original RE3 as well, for sure. Uh, each arm and one on my back. I've got this was my fourth one I got today. So I've got one on I've got a hip one. And then I've got one on my wrist and one on my right shoulder. Now I've got one on my right forearm. And then my next one will be my left forearm. Or maybe my left shoulder. I'm not sure. I kinda like the symmetry of it. I can't even lie. 
whoop, 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 whoop. Into the bus. Want one on my chest? I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Silent Hill knows his Resident Evil. Close, though. Might as well. There we go. Alright. I wonder, since we're trying things and being silly goofy, can I just knife this one? Stab. 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 Get off me! Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright. I keep thinking start menus the fucking inventory, but it's circle, which is weird. Usually my husband and I aren't impulsive with our tattoos, but we wanted to make this one a fun memory. That's fair. That's fair. I, I like to think mine out as well. But I think once in my life, I would like to get just like a small random little flash or like one that's not thought out. I say thought out like my tattoos have meanings. I just got a fucking Doom Slayer tattoo. And straight through the middle. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, whoop. I'm gonna get a transmutation circle on my chest. That's cool. I like that. Okay. Well, we made it further than last time. Hello. Gonna skeet past you real quick. It's over here. Hmm. That looks like it leads to the RPD. So I'm gonna check the other way first. See what's over here. If there's anything down here first that I wanna grab. Also, my left arm is a whatever tattoo arm. <laughs> That's fair. There's always that one spot on your body that's like the whatever spot. I can't tell what's over here. It doesn't look like anything. Was it just like a shortcut? Isn't there a herb or something in one of these planters? I swear I've heard someone say before there's a herb in one of the planters. Oh, it's just a shortcut. It, like, takes us round. Okay, sick. Maybe it's not that planter. Hello, RPD. We made it. I have my grandparents' names on each of my arms. And a Spitfire plane on my back of my great-grandfather. Nice! I personally won't get word tattoos. Um... Nothing against them, I just personally don't like the look of word tattoos on me, so I probably won't get any. I'm also not big into colour, the only colour I'm really ever going to get is like the red, like this. Again, personal preference, I just don't like the bright poppy colours. I prefer the grayscale. Brad is under there if you don't pick up anything before the RPD. Oh, interesting. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here we are. I'm going to make that a marker. What do we got? I should know this place pretty well. Never mind, the layout's different. That's like a garage door in the remake. Interesting. Okay. So RPD layout is already different. That looks almost the same, though. Loves grayscale. Yeah, like, I like when people have colour tattoos and stuff. Just for my personal tattoos that I want on me, red's going to be about the only colour you see. And even then, I may not do any other colour. This might be the only one. Oop. Ammo. Yes, please. Okay, we've got 100 ammo right now. Let me reload. All my stuff is black and white. Only color is getting a little blush on my boot. That's fair. So you're getting tattoo today? Yeah, I got it today, Remy. There it is. 
Good old Doomslayer symbol. I'm chuffed with it. There's a proper photo of it in my Discord for anyone who's curious too. Alright, we got typewriter. I won't save just yet, I want to look around first. What's on this computer? Door lock service. I do not have a card key. Sweet. And we're still on fine, which is nice. There's also no item box here. There's an item box in the remake. Alright. So, layout's already different. But it seems simpler, so it shouldn't be too bad. Getting the Pip-Boy mascot from Fallout, my right leg, which has all the games. My game sleeve, that's cool. That's cool. I like the... Personally, more of the patchwork design tattoos, so just like little ones here and there. Um, I'm probably not going to do like any full sleeves or anything. Transmutation circles because of having mental... Metal... Mental? Bars my ribs having a rebuilt knee, plus my girlfriend's a nurse. Oh yeah, fair. That's cool. Death counter at one? I don't want to talk about it. Listen, so I wasn't expecting it to just immediately throw us into a horde of like four zombies. Um, and I had like a second of panic and forgot how tank controls worked. And we got grabbed three times, which didn't kill us. But then as we sort of went along, it was literally the gate that leads to the RPD. I got grabbed like a fifth time and died. Alright, this lower floor is very simple compared to the remake. Electronically locked. What's this one? This is gonna be like, oh no, that's unlocked. Okay, maybe we should have saved. That's fine. <laughs> What's his name? Fucking Martin? Mario, Spyro, Pokemon, James Bond. Sky Fox and Banjo, that's a solo collection. Who are you? Hello, Marvin. Claire. Claire Redfield. Are you okay? I'm for my brother Chris. We lost contact with him over ten days. The gaming ago. leg, nice to Jill Berry. Every last stars team member has disappeared. They do be at the Spencer we Mansion though. Listen to them. What happened? About two months ago. There was this incident, incident involving these zombie-like creatures in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. Ooh, spooky. At the risk of their own lives. But no one believed them. Can say that again. Are you okay? Don't September in 1998 was crazy. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. Total amount I've spent on is ten thousand. Damn. Just go. Trying to add up. Okay. Just hang All on. of mine. I'll be back soon. Yeah, on like the other side of town, Jill's getting her ass beat by Nemesis. Isn't that fun? I love when stories do that crossover. Did he just lock us out? Yeah, I... Sick! Um, Galissapod in chat. Try to think what mine would add up to. One on my shoulder, I think, was about 150. This one today was 150, so that's 300. This one was about 100, so that's 400. My hip was about 800. So that's about $1,200 for all four of mine. So pretty decent, actually. <laughs> pretty decent. The hip one's the biggest. That was, that was like six hours. Okay. I think we should definitely save. Anything that stops me from getting more tattoos is no money. Exactly. That's why I'm going to get just a bunch of my smaller ones done this year. Because the person I go to is $150 for an hour. So if the small ones are only like an hour. Because this one took an hour. 
then that's doable. It is pretty good. It is pretty good for sure. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. And they're, they're an hourly rate as well. So if you go a little bit over, then a bit more. But usually they're nice. If it ends up being like a bit over an hour, like an hour and a half, they just keep it the 150, which is really good. It's got a new hookup. It's my friend's boyfriend. Oh my god. <laughs> as long as it's safe. And he's not sketchy. Good. <laughs> That's good. Alright. Do we make a save now? This is the hard part about these games is I don't know where the ink ribbons are going to be. I feel like we should make a save now before we start exploring the RPD. There we go. Alright. So. Can we unlock these other doors then? Or was it a card key he gave us? Oh, it's a card key. So that's for the computer. Okay. Gotcha. Understood. Alright. At least I've gotten used to the tank controls again pretty quickly. Yes, I will use the card key. One, two. Ah, this goes by the size of the tattoo rather than the hourly rate. That's fair. That's fair. Most of the people here are hourly. I know I've heard arguments for both. That like, oh well if you charge hourly they're not going to want to rush through it as much because they're getting paid by the hour. But then some people are like, well that means they could just go slower to get more money. I don't know. I think honestly as long as you like the artist it's whatever. Like I'm happy to pay for the art and for their time. Think of getting all the consoles I've played tattooed from the knee up. That would be cool. I am going to go through this door first, because when you play the remake, you go this way first. So we're going to go through here. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ, I hear stuff. Brother, why are there so many of you? Holy shit. Holy shit. Fuck that. I'm going to go the other way. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's a hell nah, man. Fuck that noise. They can all get slapped by Mr. X later. I don't care. <laughs> I'm, I am going this way. Okay. So this is nothing like the remake. Good to know. <laughs> Good to know. We do not go that way first. Ooh, an item box. What this? Spoiler, Mr. X will not be met yet. Isn't Mr. X only in the B runs, if I'm correct? They gotta make a living too. Exactly, like, it's a job for them. Yeah, okay, of course. Yeah, I don't have to worry about him, which is nice. That does make me feel a lot better. What's the 8th? It's late August. Just to inform everyone about the recent movement of equipment that has happened during the precinct's rearrangement. Uh, I gotta shower up. You are all good to have a wonderful evening. Thank you for hanging and chatting. I appreciate it. The safe with four-digit lock has been moved from the star's office on the second floor to the eastern office on the first floor. 2236. I'm going to take a photo of that. I know it'll be in, like, my files section, but I want to have a photo. Lurking a buttload, you're fine. You're fine, HJ. You probably just heard the scream of terror as to why there was so many and was like, oh shit, hold on. Hello? Do you do anything? No. Okay. 
It's an office over the reception desk. I don't think I have anything I want to item desk. Is that the stars, guys? Because the bottom middle looks like Jill and her beret. And the top left looks like Marvin, maybe? This is cool. What the fuck was that? Ah, oh, jeez, dude. I don't want to have to deal with the liquor already. Three degrees. It started cooling down here, actually. It, um... Didn't even hit 30 today. Our high today was 29 Celsius. And like the high for the entire rest of the week is 31. So it's starting to cool down a little bit, which is nice. I had a nap earlier today and I was just in bed with like a f floor fan on low and I had to have a blanket on. I like it though. I like it. Last night was a little chilly, huh? I don't want to go in there, dude. Okay, fine. <sighs> this is fine. They're not going to throw liquor at me, like, immediately. I can fucking hear it, dude. Really? Already? There's no way I have to fight one, like, right now. Oh, yeah, 30 is definitely still hot. But it's a lot cooler than it has been. Dude, I can hear it walking around. Games the moment. I found Claire as a wife. I, I do like this outfit on her. The, like, classic red vest. Oh, Jesus. I don't wanna. It's just dripping blood. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. A spade. Okay, so we've still got the keys. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Ah, oh, dude. Oh, it it no, it sees me. All right. At least they can't follow you out of rooms in this one like they can in the remake. Okay, we're going to have to remember there's a liquor in that hallway. Because I am not fighting that thing. We have enough ammo to kill it, but I don't really want to. Okay. Everything's fine. There's a lot less doors. Already. This place is a lot smaller than the remake. But that's probably a good thing, honestly. Okay, so we got big set of double doors. Let me come back to that. That's probably like the library or something. What's what's this? Ventilation shaft. Dark inside. That's probably going to be a later thing. Something's written. Please keep quiet while meetings are in session. What's through here? Graphics remind me of the old GTA. I mean, same console, I think. Oh, fucking hell. Dude, there's so many zombies in this place. There was like one per room in the last game. Okay. Maybe I will check out the double doors first. Okay, I don't hear any. 
So good thing about these games, at least, is you can walk into a room and sort of listen for a sec to see if there's enemies about. Nothing in the vending machine. Empty soda cans. Nothing. Is this the star's office? Looks pretty star's office-y. An operations map. Can I have it? Surely there's gotta be, like, stuff in here, though. Right? Stuff... stuff for me? No? Oh, no, there's something. Operation report. September! It was unexpectedly attacked by zombies. Many have been injured, even more were killed. During the attack, our communications equipment was destroyed, and we no longer have contact with the outside. We have decided to carry out an operation with the intent of rescuing any possible survivors, as well as to prevent this disaster from spreading beyond Raccoon City. The details of the operation are as follows. Cool. I'm not reading all that. Is that it? All right, that looks like it. What do we got through here? Ooh, spooky night statue. I don't trust this at all. Is that a item? That that looks very item like. Click, click, nope. Uh, there's nothing in here either? Oil painting hangs above it. Sacrifice to the hellfire. Okay, well that's going to be a puzzle later. A hundred percent. Nothing? Alright. I want to look at this map. See what it looks like. Okay. Pretty self-explanatory. Cool. All right. And then triangle is back for some reason. Anyway, moving along. Let let me out. There we go. Cool. So there's nothing in here. Nothing of use yet, at least. Oh, which means we have to go. Fuck, there was a liquor around here. I've forgotten already. Did you learn about the lore of the police station from the remake RE2? Uh, kind of, I guess. I don't read a lot of the notes, if I'm being honest. But I have seen many a lore video, for sure. Oh boy. Cool. I just want to get rid of a couple of these guys. Wrong person, my bad. You're all good. Whoops, reload. Oh, shit. Kick him! Yeah. Alright. And I'm comfortable running around one. I'm comfortable running around one. There is a tentacle in chat. Which it looks like I already have. Test. Does the position of zombies reset? Yes. Yes, it does. Okay. That one's a diamond. Alright, well, I don't want to go up the stairs just yet. I'm going to keep exploring down here. Oh, we got some herbs. Nice. I will take both of those, please. I know that I could do this fixed camera. It's scary. 
it's scary because you have to rely on sound to see what's coming. But you do get some benefits, like for example, because doors and stairs are transitions, zombies can't walk up stairs to get you, and they can't move between rooms. So it means if you leave and come back like I just did, it resets their position. So like there was the zombie at the base of the stairs, so I went up the stairs, and when I came back down, instead of him still being there, he was across the room at his original spawn. So you can kind of cheat it a little bit in that way, which is nice. But it does make it a lot harder to see, yeah, where enemies are coming from. And like, if they're coming at you from off screen and you're shooting, you just have to go by sound. Auto aim does help. Um, there is no auto aim in this though, that I've noticed, which is cool. Special kind of key is required. Bruh, I have a lock pick. Why can't I pick shit? Do I have to like select it maybe? No. No lock pick for me then, I guess. Old typewriter. No. Are there ink ribbons here? It is hard to get used to, but it's easy to learn, I feel like. Okay, and there's an item box here too. No ink ribbons though. Which is, uh, unfortunate. Although I think we're okay. Let me check the map. Cool. Let me, let me out. I keep forgetting that triangle is back. Sweet, so this is a dead-end save room. Oh, this is the this is the dark room. Where you can load like the photos and stuff. And like the rolls of film that you find. Okay, cool. Sweet. Well, doesn't look like there's any ink ribbons in here, so I'm not gonna save. Which means, I think we've explored down here. Okay, those two doors lead to the same room and they were locked. And then the other side of the precinct was that horde of fucking zombies. So I guess up the stairs we go. Hooray. This place is definitely smaller. There's a lot less rooms. But that's probably going to be to our benefit. Hello? Unless this top floor is just a shit ton bigger. I'm scared to run anywhere. Ooh, well that's a key item if I've ever seen one. Doors locked from the other side. Something's written on the mounting. The god of sun and the god of moon. Their gaze upon me is the only thing that can release red soul. So I betcha we have to move these statues so that they're both facing him. And probably onto these red squares. If I had to guess. Cool. That might need to go one more. Wow, this is a throwback, right? It's my first time playing it, though. So it is new to me. Alright, I'm going to do it there. Alright, and can I fit in between these guys? No. So I'm just going to push him a little bit then. Did you play the remake? Yeah, I've played the remake. But so far this is completely different. 
All the rooms are different. This puzzle wasn't in the remake. The layout's different. So, so far it is really different. So I don't think I'm going to be able to use the remake as a crutch much. Oh, thank god. I thought I pushed that too far up for a second. Yeah, no, I have played the remake. I haven't played it on stream. Um, it's one I've played in my own time. So you guys wouldn't have seen it. Well, correction. There's one episode up on my YouTube that I played when I first started streaming. So there's no camera or anything. Um, and it's like the final hour of Claire's A campaign in the remake. But I will be going back one day and playing the remake on stream. I just haven't yet. But RE2 Remake was my first Resident Evil game ever. And it's like still my favorite. Hey, first puzzle complete. What's through here? That looks like ammo? Maybe? No? That's... That's really not an item? Okay, sure. I don't feel safe in this hallway. All right, we got music, really creepy music. What do we got? Anything I can take? Various trophies. Oh, was that Chris? Marks one contest winner, Chris Redfield. Hey, nice. Oh, there is something back here. Blitz, let's go. Anything else? No. Okay. It's trashed. Dang. Nothing useful. They said there was going to be a safe somewhere. I wonder if that's in this room. Several files. Nothing useful. In the drawers. Looks like a rookie's desk. Leon's desk, maybe? Said you got a new tattoo? Yeah, it's the Doom Slayer symbol. It's kind of an awkward angle, but I like it. Oh. Oh, grenade launcher. Hello. I'll fucking take it. Anything else? No? A picture by the stars sign? Oh yeah, with like all the members. So that's... Chris is in the middle on the bottom, and then Jill's next to him. I'm pretty sure... Wesker's above Jill. And then to the right of Res Wesker, that's... Barry? I think it's Barry. The latest Doom Eternal? Yes, I have. I didn't love it as much as the 2016 Doom, but I did enjoy it. Uh, I played it when it came out. I got the DLC for it too when that came out. My favorite Doom though is actually Doom 3, which I know is an unpopular opinion. <laughs> Hell yeah, that's cool. All right. Um, I think I am going to need to go to an item box soon, huh? I'll probably drop the grenade launcher off, because I think I'm going to need that for a... Fuck. So I think I'm going to need the grenade launcher for a while, huh? I don't like how quiet it is in here.
That seems sus. That seems real sus. Hold on, let me check that map again. Okay, cool. That seems sus. I... I'm gonna go back to the item box. If I remember how to get to said item box. Yet the lack of music is creepy. This still looks like handgun bullets to me. I'm still upset that I can't pick that up. Alright. So, the item box, that's locked. Was downstairs. It, it honestly looks like an intractable item. Because it's so much brighter than the other things. Whoop! Oh. Thought I was gonna be able to sneak past him. That's fine. That's fine. How are we looking? Oh, we're, we're still in fine. Okay. We are A-OK. -okay. Tempted to play my own music during the Wii Make, but I figured it'd break the tension 100%. Don't do it. <laughs> Alright, I am going to put this away, because I feel like we're not going to need that for a while. And I'm going to put the grenade launcher away as well. Because I can't see myself using that for a bit either. Oh, God, I would love to save right about now. But I only have one ink ribbon. Hello. Goodbye. Whoop. Got to give him a... Your one, two. Alright, and let's check out that creepy, ominous door down the end. Sick. I feel like I'm flying through this, though. Whoops. It just feels so much smaller. This is very Mr. X hallway, I've got to say. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Hmm. Where to now then? Hmm. How's your headache going? Not any better, but it's not really getting worse, so I think we're okay. Mr. X, the leader of the X-Men. Fuck yeah. All right, well, that means the only place we have to go is the other side of the precinct <clears throat> that had that, like, 50 fucking zombies. So maybe we do get the grenade launcher and get rid of those guys, but I don't want to waste a shot on just, like, regular zombies. What, Jade? <laughs> what? Yeah, it's not really getting worse. Definitely not better, though. Oh. Quagsire? You are all good, Swaggy. Have a good sleep. Have a good night. You seen the new X-Men? Nah. I'm not really a big Marvel person, honestly. <sighs> but here, where it starts with pre, I gotta do it. Of course you do, Jade. If I just stand here, he won't move. Ah. <laughs> uh, I feel like we do grenade launcher. Whoop, 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 whoop. I feel like we gotta. That's the only way we're gonna get through that horde. And there's nowhere else for us to go.
We've checked all the other doors. I'm still salty that I only have one ink ribbon. That's upsetting. Whoop, 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 whoop. And then this way, and then this way. Thank you for the TikTok follow, I appreciate it. Yeah, I think I'll try and go for the full three hours today, which would be another hour and a half. I don't remember what's liquor hallway and what's not. Oh! Not good, not good, not good. Okay, that didn't hurt me, that's fine. So there's nothing in there. Yeah, this is liquor hallway. Woolacy. Oh, for fuck's sake, dude. All right, I'm going to I'm going to stick to this wall. Fuck you. Is that hurting me? No. Yeah, you're all good, Jay. Get yourself some sleep as well. And I'm pretty sure this is liquor hallway. Yup. Is that a herb? Oh, so it is. Uh, that noise is new. Is that the sound of the fucking liquor breathing? Ew. Sounds like me in the morning. Oh. You didn't hear anything. Excuse me? Excuse me. Oh my god. How did it hear me? Bitch, I wasn't doing anything. That's all three of my herbs. Go fuck yourself. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. That's rough. Liquor, I hardly know it. Oh god. That's gonna be the stream title tomorrow. Dude, that's rough. Maybe I should kill it. I, I don't want to waste all my grenade rounds, though. Is this still locked? Yeah. Alright, well. I think... It is grenade launcher time. Can't believe that used all three of my herbs. Oh, come on. I mean to shoot them. Oh, that wasted so many. Can I go in here? Yeah. Zombies. Oh my god, dude. Whoop! Dude, they're fucking everywhere. Shit. Bloody hell. He is so gonna grab me. feel it. I arrived at the party, I didn't realise it was an orgy. No. I can't 
reach him. Yeah, I knew it. Get him! Get him! Get him! Bop. Whoops. They're fucking everywhere. Please. Anything on these desks? No. Alright, he's fine. I can I can probably ignore him. Let me go around the other way, actually. See what's over here. What that? <gasps> More ink ribbons. Yes. Yes, good. Nothing. I want to know what that thing is. Looks important. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Can he come in here? Is the question. I don't know. Press, press, anything. Nope. Okay, I think he can come in here. Now, we had the the key for this. They told us in the note. Um, 2236. Two, two, three, six. Woo. Acid rounds. And a map. Sick. Okay. Does that just expand my map? Yeah. Yeah. All right. And it tells us like what doors are locked and stuff. Neat. So I'm pretty sure blue is the spade door and pink is the diamond door. All right. Cool. Ooh. And then this is new. Are you holding something? You look like you're holding something. Yeah. That looks like an exit sign. That also looks like an exit sign. Let me check the map. Alright, so this should be locked according to the map. Yeah, that one's the heart door. Cool. Alright. Let me consult this for a second. So we're done upstairs. Got the stairwell we can go through. Got there's another door I didn't check there. Apparently. All right. Unless that was locked. Okay. So red doesn't mean locked. Sweet. So I think we should go this way. Yeah. Ooh, more herbs. Yes, please. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I am going to grab both of these. Whatever that creepy noise is happening in the background, I don't love it. I'll combine them if I need to. Although I should probably go back to an item box at some point. Is this just a little, like, shortcut? Ooh, another herb. Good morning, Philippe. Is that Philippe? 
Yes, welcome in. It is evening for me, though. It's 6 p.m. Locked from inside. You bastard. You bastard. Okay. I. Can I combine these? Ooh. What are these ones, then? Just regular grenade rounds. Okay, let me swap that back out, then. I'll combine these. Pick up this one, and then we are going to move our booties to an item box. What? So what time is it for you, then? If it's morning. Go to bed. You are all good, Katsu. You are fine. Have a wonderful night. Thank you so much for stopping in and for the follow. I do appreciate it. Hopefully we will see you again next time. I'll probably be live around the same time tomorrow. 5 a.m.? Dang, you're up early. Let me in. There we go. It was awesome to meet you as well. I appreciate you stopping by. I do, I do. Actually, yeah, there was another door here we didn't check out, huh? Yeah, because I was stressed out by this guy. Although, yeah, he's the only one left, so I can just skip. Oh my god, dude, there's herbs frickin' everywhere. Okay. We need to get to an item box. Is there nothing here? Hold on. There's nothing here except that herb. Oh, I almost ran straight into him. Okay. In that case, then. The herb was illegal! Green herbs are fine. I am going to kill that liquor, I think, actually. I know I said I was going to leave it, but clearly it hits me twice and I drop to danger. So I'm not dealing with that shit. It doesn't tell me which rooms are save rooms, does it? Nope. But I do remember that room by the stairs on the left was a save room. So we are going to make our way back there. Playing the PS1 DualShock. This isn't the DualShock version, unfortunately. This is just like the standard version. Let me go back. I keep forgetting that Triangle is back. But being that it's my first playthrough, I, I want to experience it genuinely. Actually, this is the liquor thing, isn't it? Let me get this guy out. GameCube. Nope. <laughs> nope, this is just the original PS1 version. Oh, there's an item box right here. Okay, sick. In that case, then, I'm gonna put them away. Um, mm, yeah, I'll put these away because this item box is on the way to a typewriter anyway. Gotta play the DualShock version. I didn't even know there was a difference, and now I'm kind of regretting it. All right, go grab that other herb, and then where were we going? Where are we going? That's a good question. There is a pincer in chat. Do I have a pincer? I do not. Alright. So that needs a key. That needs a key. That needs a key. Pretty sure that one's just locked. I know you guys don't know what I mean when I say that one. So I can't point. Hmm. Where do we go next? Interesting. Anyway, we'll go grab that other green herb and equip this again since we're not going to like a hallway just yet. Where do we go next? 
all the doors I can think of are locked. Let me check the map again. The only one I can think of is that yellow one next to the flashing pink one on the left. But I'm pretty sure that was locked. Yeah, it is, because we can't get in there. We can't get in there anyway. Find this one the easiest of the whole series. I've heard a couple people say that, actually. Which is why I'm not feeling too bad about it. I just don't know where to go. Everything's locked now and needs special key. We've got one diamond, one spade, and I think one club or something. But we need the three different keys. Oh, that's right. There was nothing here. Oops. Oh, wait. This is new. I didn't go this way before. Yeah, I think probably excluding spin-offs. Okay, I didn't go in here. Hello? Oh shit, you're right there. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Hello? Oh, jeez. Alright. Alright. Nope. Nope. Fuck. Nope. Jesus Christ. Bloody hell. There's a lot. Okay. Oh my god. Nom. That didn't even raise me a state? Okay. Which way am I facing? I want to go in here. Shit. <laughs> Shit. Okay. I should probably kill a couple of these guys, to be fair. Oh, look, a red herb. For the green herb that I just ate. How perfect. Okay, I can go in here, though. Outbreak 1 and 2. RE0 might be the toughest. Oh, boy. We will be playing the Outbreak games at some point. Okay. Well, this is new. So that's good. Nope, I can't walk that way. All right. Well, that looks like handgun ammo on the desk, so I'm just going to go ahead and, uh... Sweet. And I clearly can't get through there. Although, these guys should be back at the start now. So we should be okay. To just check the other door, and then uh, move on. Oh, fuck! Why are you right there? Bro! What's in here then? Oh, of course it's locked. Fucking perfect. Alright. I might just have to take these guys out, honestly. I've got... A bit of ammo, at least. Revelations 3 would be so good. I loved the first Revelations. I haven't gotten around to the second one yet, because I'm playing them in order. So we're doing two original, then three original, and then we'll do one remake, and then we'll go back to the main series. So we've got to do five, then Revelations 2, 6, 7, 8. I don't trust him. He's convulsing. I can hear the other ones. Why are they not coming to me? Hello, Tyson. Welcome, Ian. Fuck it. I'm just gonna... Okay, he's fine. Oh, jeez. Back the fuck up. I'm sorry? Can you not leap forward at me like that? Alright, book it. Whoops. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Thank you for the friendship necklace, I appreciate it. I'm stressed right now, I'm sorry. 
And the roses as well. Combine that. Wonderful. Okay, are we good now? No? Okay, you know what? I can dodge one. That's fine. I just wasn't about to dodge fucking three. Okay, so is that everything in here then now? Yes. Yes, it is. Cool. So I still don't know where to go. And back down here. Alright, well we'll go back to where we found that other green herb. Oh, my headache is starting to kind of feel bad though. Problem is... Oh, here's a green herb. Did we grab that one on the stairs? I don't remember. I'm gonna go back and check. Where were the stairs though is the question. I feel like maybe it was through here. I don't know. Map. Yes, it was through here. Okay, cool. And this place was clear. So we can just... Pretty sure it was this way. Yeah, he's just chilling in the office now. Yeah, it was this way. Alright. Cool. Uh, but yeah, I'm not 100% sure where to go now. All the doors I have access to are locked. I did grab that herb. Okay, cool. Um. So let's map check. Upper floor. Cool. Upper floor is locked by a special key. Lower floor. Red door is locked. Green and pink door are locked. Pink door on the left is locked. Blue door on the left is locked. I don't know where to go. Unless maybe the office that Marvin was in it has unlocked itself is the only thing I can think of. But everything else is locked. And I don't have keys. Go around this way. And we'll get back to the lobby. Get back to the lobby so I can do some item box stuff. And then probably save soon. Which I am going to combine them. There we go. Alright. Well, that's probably all the herbs that are in this place as well. So we're going to have to start being careful now. Um, check Martin's office. Nope. Still locked. Still locked. So I am not 100% sure. Item box. Uh, we might actually be okay. What's this jewel? Can I examine it? 
blood red jewel about the size of a fist. That doesn't help. Although it's now called a virgin heart. Hmm. If this is the office on the other side of this, can I interact with anything? Nope. This doesn't do anything. I think. Nope, definitely doesn't. Hmm. I don't know where to go. Interesting. Can I check the trash can, maybe? Nope. All right, then. I think I am probably going to save and call it an hour early, though. The headache's not necessarily getting worse. Oh, that's a lie. It kind of is getting worse. It's kind of getting worse. <laughs> I guess. So, yeah, I might call it an hour early. So we'll get, we'll get rid of this liquor. We'll get to the save room. And then we will call it. And then we'll work out where to go next time. That's the fucking liquor. Uh, I don't know where it is. Whoop! Oh, Jesus. Alright. Two grenade shots and a handgun bullet. Sick. And this was locked. Yeah, that's the spade. Alright, lick is dealt with. Awesome. Um, does this do anything? No. That's okay. See, I didn't mind Revelations 1, actually. I will say there was a lack of enemy variety. But that was about my only complaint with it. I actually quite enjoyed it. And the item scanning mechanic was a little... Mm, but it was fun. Stay away from the boards this time. And then... Save room was this way. I'm pretty sure. Yes. There we go. He can stay. Wanna cosplay as Miss Redfield? I did a uh, RE2 remake cosplay as her once. It was just like a closet cosplay though, so it wasn't anything special. Oh, there is an item box in here. All right. Ooh, a Rosalia. There are ink ribbons here. I didn't see them before. Okay, I should not have been worrying about saves then. All right. Let me type typewriter. Hello. There we go. All right. We'll save, and I am gonna drop out an hour early today. Not that I can probably do much about my headache anyway, but at least get out of the lights and go lay down and stuff. There we go. All right. So, that is going to be where we leave it for today. Let me go ahead, close the game, turn the console off. I hope so too, Remy. I hope so too. 
hopefully it's gone tomorrow. But I definitely, I'm going to swap pillows tonight, see if that helps at all. Get some heat packs and stuff on my neck. Try and rub it out as best I can. It fucking hurts, though. It really does. I am going to go ahead and end the TikTok live here, though. So anyone on TikTok, thank you very much for hanging out. I appreciate it. If you would like, feel free to come on over to the Twitch side of things. The username is just above me there. And enjoy all the fun sound alerts and channel points and everything. Otherwise, I will hopefully see you guys tomorrow for some more Resident Evil 2. Goodbye. There we go. TikTok is done. I can turn that off. Why are you leaving? My headache is getting worse, HJ. So I uh, need to go lay down, get out of the lights and deal with it. Uh, but we made good progress, though. Um, we've basically, aside from like the spade and the heart doors and stuff, from what I can tell, cleared out the RPD. Um, so I just have to work out where to go next <laughs> is the problem. Thank you for being here, Loon. I appreciate it. Thank you all very much. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, so yeah, in saying all of that, hopefully stream will still be going ahead tomorrow. It is scheduled for 5 p.m. tomorrow. So that's about an hour and a half ago, but tomorrow. Um, if, of course, there's any changes or I need to cancel or anything, which, fingers crossed, I won't need to, but if it happens, then you'll be able to find that information in my Discord, as well as all my other socials for anyone who is interested. I'm curious to see how this YouTube video is going to go with the boob. We'll see what happens. So far, it reckons it's good to go. But... We will see once it's been up for a little bit. Um, but yeah, I think that's about everything otherwise. Um, I'm probably not going to raid tonight. Um, just because I feel like shit. <laughs> and I'm probably going to have to like pretty much... Well, I'll basically be doing my post-stream things and then going and laying in bed. So I'm probably not going to raid tonight which kind of makes me sad, but that's okay. Um, so I think that's about it then. So fingers crossed we're still on for tomorrow. If we are, we'll be playing more RE2. Um, if uh, anything changes, I will, of course, let you guys know in Discord uh, as soon as I can. I also have my grocery shopping tomorrow after morning. Tomorrow after morning? Tomorrow morning. So hopefully my headache's gone for that as well but thank you all very much for being here I appreciate it thank you for the follows today and everyone for coming and hanging out I appreciate it I got to meet so many new people tonight which was awesome um yeah we're also already at 850 we're getting close to 900 which is scary uh we're also getting close to 800 on tiktok too everything's moving so fast this is crazy. Anyway, I apology. I apologies. See, I can't fucking talk now. I apologize about the short end. Um, hopefully, we will still be on for tomorrow. But like I said, I will let you guys know. So until I see you next, I hope everyone has a wonderful night or morning, has a wonderful time zone. Stay safe, look after yourself, and I will see you next time. Good night.